Hey, what's up guys? Jeremy with Everything iDevice and welcome to a Xbox 360 controller kind of review. Uh, this isn't going to be a full review, but it is more so of a overview. I received this controller yesterday and I've been using it for a day. Uh, it is a 17 mode modded Xbox 360 controller, obviously. Uh, and also, as you can see, it does have a custom kind of blue button and light kind of theme to it, which I think looks really awesome. Uh, definitely a very unique, cool looking controller. Uh, but before I get into explaining this controller, I just want to let you guys know that uh, I was going to put this on my gaming channel, but I decided to put it over here just because I thought you guys might get a kick out of this video. Now, anyways, uh, this controller is basically going to be a project controller for me. This is going to be my designated gaming controller. I do have the Halo 4 spe uh, Special Edition controller, uh, but since it has kind of the high gloss plastic, my hands tend to get a little bit more sweaty and I lose grip on it quite a bit. So I figured I would invest a little money here and uh, make myself my own custom gaming controller. Now yes, this is modded and like I said, I've been using it for about a day and uh, it's ultimately been getting me killed more than it's been helping me. Uh, I think it's something to more so get used to. Uh, do keep in mind this can get you banned from Xbox just because obviously in a way it's kind of cheating. Uh, but my in my opinion, you know, drop shotting and uh, uh, rapid fire really doesn't give that much of an advantage for my usage of it. Uh, I tend to just been churning it off and using, you know, I'm just way too used to, uh, to uh, Black Ops 2's, you know, normal feeling mechanics of the game. Uh, so I've been, you know, tending to churn it off. But I, I wanted to try out a modded controller at least once. I've never owned one before, so I figured I would just give it a shot. Now, like I said, this does have 17 modes. I will leave a link down in the description if you guys would like to check out this specific controller. I'll also leave a link in the description for kind of like a, a, a general uh, modded controller search. And it's all within Amazon. They do have the best prices. I got this for 88 bucks. It's normally 160 so it's almost 50% off. Uh, definitely not a bad price in my opinion. Um, now, like I said, of course, this is modded. And one thing that I got confused about at first when I got it was... Uh, well, how do you activate it? I figured there'd been about like a button down here or something or something out of the ordinary on this controller. Uh, but I didn't really look into it too much. I just kind of bought it. So I decided to go on YouTube and obviously I searched up and found it, how to use it. So I figured I would show you guys as well. So the way you activate the mods, cause right now it's running basically as a normal 360 controller, uh, no mods right now. All you got to do is hold down the left trigger, go ahead and press the sync button. And then the lower right hand, uh, ring light right there will turn on you do have both on right now as you can see and it is in modded mode um, now like I said there are 17 different modes uh, it does get a bit confusing you might have to open up a custom game and kind of cycle through the mods to figure out what you want to use uh, it does come with rapid fire it does come with drop shot it does come with auto aim uh, it does come with quick scope uh, it comes with basically everything it does work on I think all of the call of duties also, I believe uh, Halo and other games, I guess you guys would just have to look more into it depending on your game of choice. Uh, so I don't even know what mode it is right, is right now. I think it might be in drop shot, but I can't remember. And the way you cycle through the different modes is you basically just click the sync button. As you can see, that light flashes and it switches to the next mode. Uh, another thing that's very cool, which I haven't really figured out too much about yet, but I think I'll be looking into it, is the 17th mode is a customizable uh, user mode where you can actually customize it um, like I said I'll do more of a video on that once I get you know more in tuned with all the mods and uh, get more familiar with how this thing works exactly I just wanted to give you guys a nice overview so I guess I'll give you guys a little bit of a close-up of this controller uh, like I said it's basically just a regular controller regular Xbox 360 controller with some nice blue accents on it I'm actually gonna be changing that here uh, shortly when I get more of my parts in here. I'm gonna go more for the all-black look I actually have some some pretty awesome thumbsticks coming. I think you guys might get a kick out of it Also a really cool d-pad uh, I guess I'll just show you more of that when it the time comes, but just make sure you stay tuned in uh, Because this should be a pretty awesome customized designated badass gaming controller uh, But yeah, as you can see nothing out of the ordinary uh, just a normal black 360 controller and it's just got the really cool looking blue on it. Uh, I do like the blue, but I think the murdered out black might be a little bit more cool. Uh, again, it's all personal preference, and there's tons of different color schemes on Amazon. I would suggest you guys checking out if you guys are interested in it. And uh, that's pretty much it. Again, links are in the description if you guys want to see this specific controller. Uh, there's a whole description on it on what modes are and what it offers. Uh, definitely worthy of taking a look at. Um, 
and that's pretty much it guys this is the 17 mode modded controller and this is the blue version blue and black so if you guys did enjoy this video be sure to throw a thumbs up also if you guys have any questions you can go ahead and ask down in the comments and if you guys do like gameplays and you like videos kind of like this be sure to jump over to my gaming channel and subscribe there i do have some pretty awesome gameplays and uh yeah that's gonna be it guys i'll catch you guys in the next one peace